horses are on the track and pretty the pose for the sixth race. This is the second division of the Governor's Cup trot for three-year-old Colt Trotters, Ohio State Fair Stakes, a trot of one mile, purse of $23,400. Exact is in tries, a field of seven, no changes. The one is He's Easy by Slaughter, Davis, and Spearman and Davis. They're of Kentucky, Pennsylvania, and Ohio, trained and driven by Tom Davis. Number two is Dalton's Flyby by John Red and Betty Shaw, Mount Vernon, Ohio, trained by Marty Willem with Dave Hawk. Number three is Final Legacy by Gary Reynolds at Crestline, Ohio, trained and driven by Dan Reynolds. Number four is In the Chase by Wandat Golf Course of Centerburg, Ohio, and Tom York, Jr., trained by Jim Artledge, Jr., Dallas Miller. The five is Naptown Wiz by the White Creek Stable Incorporated at Dublin, Ohio, trained by Ray Paver, Sam Chipnoble III. Number six is Son of a Preacher Man by Stack, Fizzle, Condon, and Smolko, all of Ohio, trained and driven by Ron Stack. And for the outside of the seven is That's All He Wrote, owned by Lou, Waterman, and Willis. They're all of Ohio, trained by Jim Mullinex, Jim Daly, and the Sulky. Field of seven, swing to the back stretch. Approaching the start, field in motion. They're all fan trotting and firing away for the lead. There goes Final Legacy driving away from the inside. He's easy from the outside. There is Son of a Preacher Man who's on the go. Coming away, trotting in four. That is Don's flyby to the inside in five is in the chase. Then we come back to the two trailers here in the early stages, which are Naptown Wiz, and that's all he wrote. Can see them all. As they trot around the first turn and over to the opening quarter and from the inside, Final Legacy, but up on the outside, Son of a Preacher Man. These two are slugging it out as they reach the opening quarter, the opening quarter in 28 and 3 fifths, and Final Legacy has hung out Son of a Preacher Man out there on the outside, racing in two, along the inside, He's Easy was watching over the dealing leaders from third, fourth, that is Don's flyby, fifth and a move to the outside is in the chase, sixth there along the inside is Naptown Wiz, and seventh in trailing the field, that's all he wrote, as they trot around the clubhouse turn and make their way towards the half, and Final Legacy is leading it here by length and a quarter, to the inside, He's Easy is trotting in second. They're halfway home in 59 and 3 fifths. First over hung the mile. Racing in third is Son of a Preacher Man. To the inside, locked in in fourth. That is Don's flyby. Second over the outside. Racing in five is in the chase. Sixth there is Naptown Wiz and seventh in trailing the field. That's all he wrote. Down the back side they go and on top, final legacy with the lead here. Here to the inside. He's easy as trotting in second. Swung up three deep. Here comes in the chase and Dallas Miller has sent this one underway as they trot towards three quarters. Three quarters on the board in 129 and two fifths. They'll drop the final turn and head for home. And final legacy with the lead here by three parts of a length. But now bearing down on the outside in the chase is coming to play. He's easy down along the inside is trotting in third. Off the turn to the top of Power Alley. Less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come in the Governor's Cup trot with the lead. Final legacy in the chase is coming to him and coming on. But as they draw within the final 16th, final legacy in front. Finishing second in the chase. Third was the one. He's easy. Time of the mile, 158. Four fifths. Final legacy. And a new lifetime mark takes the second division of the Governor's Cup trot. Pick three, three of three, two fourteen forty. Track side of the winner's circle, the official winner of the sixth race, Governor's Cup Trot, second division for three-year-old Colt Trotters, Ohio State Fair Stakes, a purse of $23,400. Here's the three final legacy, Gate to Wire, posting the first win in 2003 in a new lifetime mark, 158 and four fifths. A three-year-old bait coat by Striking Sombra out of a win her finale bear, she by final score. By Gary Reynolds at Crestline, Ohio, nicely trained and driven by Dan Reynolds. The three final legacy, new lifetime mark, 158 for Favs. In the winner's circle to make the trophy presentation for the Governor's Cup trot, the vice president of Sound of Downs, Mrs. Laverne Hill. Three. 4632-1440. As we move on to race number seven here this evening, this is the second division of the Ohio's First Lady Pace for three-year-old pacing fillies. Scratch the seven worthy ladies sick. I'm at five, six, and two. 